and made them pay. The Celtics with the lead. Here's Pippen. Ooh, a two-handed power slam. Woohoo, just great work cashing in on the fast break. Great job of reading the... What is it at? Slot 38. All right, who, who do they got? Point guard, they get Kevin Johnson. Shooting guard, Ray Allen. Small forward, Bob Dandridge. Power forward, Dirk Nowitzki. And center, Zadronis Elgaskis. Hi, everyone. Alongside Grant Hill and Steve Smith, I'm Brian Anderson. We'll hear from Ali LaForce in just a moment. And this team is playing so well right now. You can tell they love being on the floor together. It's it's great chemistry, and of course, it's translating into wins. Credit has to go to this coaching staff. Ah, I jumped too early. The play fits this roster, and every guy seems to be accepting his role. Now the starting group for the visitors. Pass to Ilgauskas. And here in the middle of the season, these teams really coming into their own right now. They found their identity and know what they're all about, Grant. Well, oftentimes that's what happens. I mean, these guys have had the time to gel and get to know. I gotta stop like dribbling play. in traffic. At this point, it's all about going out night after night and just executing. Here's Marbury to the left wing. Launches a three. The Grady shot is off. Here's Dandridge. To the right side. Ty Johnson. Shot clock at six. 14 feet away. Rebound Boston. The ball's not Fuck! Ooh, stolen by Allen. Oh, and Johnson slams it in. What a I'm like dribbling play. into them. It's Just annoying. Tremendous. Yeah, the steal was slick. The slam topped it off. Turning defense into offense. Every coach talks about it. Perfect example right there. Now here's Jordan. Here's Duncan. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting. So he'll take two free throws. First personal foul. First team. And he knocks down the first one. At the line for the Jim Duncan. At the line for two shots. On both. All right, focus up, focus up. Stop playing like a douche. Pass to Allen. Here's Nowitzki. And here's Allen. Nice start for him. Sinking his first shot. This is a play. This is why you run your offense through him and live with the results. Here he goes. I thought Elgaskis was going to come over. I was ready to toss it to uh, Porzingis, but... Another foul. Here we go. Let's get the foul started. Let's get the foul started. Johnson. 
pass to Nowitzki. Two minutes remaining in the with the fadeaway. Two minutes. The shot I knew that was going in. That's just a solid execution to get a wide open look. Kevin Johnson. 151 left to play in the first. Inside. Here's Porzingis. Now we know he can hit threes, but Chris Stapp's showing he can slam it too. And there's 138 left in the opening quarter. Damn, 25th. to see where everyone in the league stands. They're a rising team climbing to fifth on the board. Seeing where Boston is, they've had an intriguing start to the season. Recently, they've strung together some wins. You get the feeling that their confidence is really growing. That's the shot you hope for. Right at the rim, just couldn't capitalize. Here's Pippen. Dude, why didn't Pippen just stay in the corner? Like, I, I sent him to the corner. Rock. It's broken. I know how to pass to the corner. I know how to use lead passing. Pass to Jordan. So he draws the foul. Foul. I get him to miss, but it's a foul. Then how about we check the numbers for him? Shooting for the OA team. DeAndre Jordan. The line throws good. Jordan. And for all the developments Jordan's made to his game, free throw shooting remains a challenge. He makes one or two that time. Austin Trailer. Here's Bryant. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Just owning the painted area. If it's working, no need to change. Pass to Smith. Forty-one seconds left in the first quarter here. Now here's Jordan. Bridges outside. Elbow shot. And there's the bucket. Staying with it that time. Offensive okay. Pass, getting it done. Okay. Yeah, this is Jordan's mindset. Trying to extend the play and convert that effort into points. Pass to Camby. 15 seconds left in the first quarter. Nash. Here's Stoudemire. From 13. The shot no good. Here's Abdul Raouf. Goes up and lays it in nice and easy. And despite the size mismatch, getting a little aggressive down there in the paint. Proving once again that when you attack with confidence, good things tend to happen. Uh. And we've reached the end of the first quarter, leading by five. Entertainment, everyone. Come on, make some noise. If you're just joining us, we played through one quarter in this one. And what do you guys think about the visitors here in this one? Well, so far, they've got things rolling along nicely at the offensive end. This is exactly what you want to see if you're a coach. Your team starting fast mm -hmm. and playing with confidence. You can see that. It's all tangled up. I mean, serious mm -hmm. crossover. Grant, we always talk about great footwork for post players, but how about perimeter players? You know, I'm glad you brought that up, EA. Great perimeter players have elite footwork. The footwork helps to create the opportunity to score. Whether that's shooting a three off the dribble or even in the post up. Great, elite, fantastic, iconic guards who can do it all have superior footwork. Believe that. Here's Stoudemire. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. To the middle. I almost turned that ball over three times in that possession because I kept passing it to the wrong guy. I got lucky. Got lucky. Pass to Allen. Back to Johnson. And here's Allen. Here's Nowitzki. Another foul, of course. First, personal foul, first team foul. 
shooting for the away team. I might have to back off my defensive pressure and go to like neutral or something. This physical defense is getting me in trouble. That free throw oh my god, Nowitzki missed a free throw? What the hell? And he's good on the second. And we played to the first minute here in the second. Nash. Pass to Cammy. On the wing, Brian. Chance there to take the lead, but a miss. What a defensive play. Gets the stop and does it without foul. They get the rebound. And here's Boston. They've only given up one point in the second quarter. That one coming at the line. What the hell kind of pass was that? God! Shot from 16. And can't get it. He's now one of three. Wow, that's one you just kind of assume is going in. Tough luck. Here's Nash, covered by Johnson. Brian against Tower. Down low. Here's Nash. Good. And the assist to Brian. He's got five. Getting enough shots in close. Five didn't steal inside. that one. And that streaking rack attack is the mobile one drive. They're taking the onus on himself to make something happen. Got it into the teeth of the defense and made them pay. Celtics with the lead. Here's Pippen. Ooh, a two-handed power slam. Ooh, just great work cashing in on the fast break. Great job of reading the floor, got to the rim, and made a play. Trying to find a spark here. Yes, indeed, a rough stretch offensively. They could really use a basket. Here's Johnson. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. First, first one. Hey, if you can't block it, sending him to the line can be the next best thing. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from for the Celtics. For me, they made a point to attack inside early in the game, and it's paid off for them. A lot of solid looks in the paint. And following off of what you said, they've really done a good job distributing the ball. Passing up good shots. Great job drawing the foul. And almost converted the shot as well. Give me that. Give me those free throws. At the line for your Celtics. Michael Jordan. It throws good. Jordan for two. And both free throws good for Jordan. We've seen him put a lot of pressure on the defense and then cash in at the line. Pass to Allen. Jordan with it. Come on, Camby. Got nothing for you. Two shots, what? Two mates. Off to a good start. Attacking in the painted area. I like this approach. It's where DeAndre's at his best. It's a drive. No. Too easy. That's too easy. I just love the aggressive finish. Now I'm thinking he's sending a strong message with that jam. All right, come on, defense. Come on, defense. It's gonna miss here. Pass to Allen. Here's Abdul Raouf. Here's Novitski. Good rebound. Good rebound. One reason this game is so tight is because both teams are hitting the boards with reckless abandon. That wasn't the best pass because Davitsky was standing right at me. He could have easily had stolen that. Jam that one home. And 
this kind of six lane if there was a big guy down in the paint i was going to shoot a jump shot but i noticed that it was uh you know there's an edge the way they play mood i do our oof the little guy and that replay courtesy of the at&t 5g slam cam Wow, why are you following Cammy? Substitution on the court. There's 37 seconds left in the first half of this one. Smith passes to Jordan. Back to Smith. Shot clock at two over Jordan. And that one's long. And Boston has possession. Seven point game, biggest lead so far. Defeated by Washington in their last game. They'll try to put that one behind them. You know, in that game, it was just too much disparity in effort level between the two teams, especially on the glass. You know, you can't allow that many second chance opportunities and then get almost none yourself. Rarely that works out for them. And so we've reached the end of the first half of play. It's the Celtics, they lead by seven. And we'll be right back after halftime for the start of the third quarter. See you in just a bit. That was a great second quarter. A great second quarter. I didn't hit any jump shots, though. Didn't really have to. Didn't really have to. Hey, welcome back to the NBA on 2K Sports. This is Ernie Johnson. Kenny the Jet Smith is right here. Say hey to the folks, Kenny. Hey, folks. Say hey to the yeah, folks, Shaq. Hey, folks. Hey, let's get this party started. Boston found themselves in a close game in the first. They stayed within arm's reach in that opening period. Five points, their largest deficit. They were a finely tuned unit in the second quarter, easily outscoring their counterparts and getting in front by seven points at the end of the half. And let's get your thoughts, Big Bella, on the Celtics. The difference so far has been the efficiency of the offense. The ball movement is really good. I'm not afraid to use the whole shot clock if they have to. Overall, they're making every position. How about you, Kenny? What did you think about the visiting team? A combination of four shooting. That's what we like to see. 62 versus 33. Probably going to by seven. Turnovers, I guess. Oh, and balls, I guess. And that'll do it for our halftime report. Stay tuned for the second half. About to get underway. Why was Kenny Smith just saying the same thing? <laughs> what? He was lip syncing what uh, uh, Johnson, Ernie Johnson was saying. That was weird. Fans, please give a big round of applause. Well, for those just tuning in, thanks for being with us. Second half of this game still to play. And Boston has possession. Seven point differential. Here's Marbury. Outside Porzingis. And the three pointer goes. Porzingis. Porzingis has got five now. You big stretch the floor like Porzingis. He can be just deadly from the arc. Pass to Dandridge. Here's Nowitzki. Defended by Porzingis. Good rebound. What's your big plan B? Rips it down and track. And for the Celtics. Out left to the wing. There's Duncan. Gets a very good look at the Burks. He has six. He's pouring it on at a nice clip, and the rest of the team is stuffing up as well. Here's Danbridge. About a minute played here in the second half. Down to five on the shot clock. With the blows, yep, that's going to be a travel. Ooh, a travel. I thought that was a foul. So nice. get frustrated when you make mistakes. Have to keep battle. It's just one trip down the court. But you have to have short memory in this league or you won't last long. Here's Marbury, covered by Johnson. Pass to McGrady. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. She have shot that jump shot, but personal foul. First team foul. At the line for the Celtics. Tracy McGrady. At the line for two shots. The first free throw is good.
And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. And here's Johnson. He's got six. The coach definitely wants to talk about their interior defense, which has not been impressive. It's a matter of want to. Helping out with just the shots. You have to want to make the effort. With Celtics Entertainment, everyone, give them a hand. Pass to Ilgowskis. Here's Dandridge. Back to Johnson. Allen with it, covered by Jordan. Clock at six. Here's Dandridge. Well, he hasn't put up any points yet on this one. And they're plus five on the boys after that rebound. From deep, Jordan. The rebound ah. by Gauskas. Jordan's gone. Good, good One close three up. on the night. All right, let's check in with Allie LaForce. Thanks, guys. The NBA last season celebrated its 75th anniversary and announced the 75 greatest players in NBA history, gathering the living greats during the All-Star break. A lot of history, but Commissioner Silver said, we're a pretty young league when you think about it. Brian, I guess it's all relative. Damn, another foul. Thanks for that, Allie. I'm just trying to play good defense. Second personal foul. First two foul. The first one falls, and the Celtics making a change here. Taking two shots. That one falls, so he hits both of them. When your big can make free throws, I was just trying to play good defense. Advantage. Love his approach to get to the line. Here's Marbury, covered by Johnson. Right wing. What? Ah! Duncan's playing center, not power forward. Shit. That's me not paying attention. Got a piece of it. Pass to Dandridge. Here's Ilgowskis. And he was camped in the lane there. Nice. He gets a three second ball. It's so easy to get frustrated when you make mistakes. But you have to keep battling. It's just one trip down the court. But you have to have short memory in this league or you won't last long. Simon has checked in for Boston. Third quarter here and three minutes have come off the clock. Here's Pippen. Oh, and he got oh, fouled geez. on his way up. He'll head to the line. I got to remember to uh, do the Euro steps and that. On Mikhail Bridges. On those particular plays. At the line, Scotty Pippen. At the line for two. First one falls for him. Are you yelling MVP for Pippen? What the hell? I mean, they're chanting it. Kind of hear it. Not anymore. And so he hits both. You know, for team owners, it often seems best not to take too active a role in basketball decisions. Two minutes. Greg, you're a team owner. How do you feel about this? Well, it's a tough situation, VA. Many of these owners have made tremendous amounts of money building their fortunes, of course, being very hands on with their business. What? Business. Success is not always linear. And sometimes as an owner, you're not an expert when it comes to this particular business. So it's interesting kind of being engaged, but not being too hands-on and letting your people do their jobs to the best they can. Second chance effort. And it's Simon's missing. Tremendous. What was Jordan's release? Was that saving a bucket right there? You know what? This is why you never give up on a play. You don't know what's going to happen. Raheem, no good. They put together a solid lead. And it doesn't seem like they're going to back off. Fuck, I got to stop dribbling and dribbling in traffic. Here's Abdul Rauf. Doesn't go for him. Now the Celtics take it the other way. Simon's outside. Pass to Pippen. Here's Stoudemire. So it looks like the Celtics will retain possession here. Johnson, he's checked in for Smith. Substitution on the court. 
There's 42 seconds left to play in the third. Come on, grab that board, man. Here's Abdul Raouf. Here's Johnson. And he takes it in for the layup off a very nice feed. Johnson's got eight. They just look so overwhelmed inside. Yeah, that's why they continue to get attacked. Here's Nash. He's got five. Oh, a big finish with a one-handed jam. Nice one-handed Take it, man. Jam. Take it. Simple I'll take it. BA. Hey, with the lead, I'm surprised he didn't come up with something a little more creative. Here's Abdul Raouf. to Raheem. That shot off the mark. And so it's Boston now holding a 12-point lead at quarter's end. They hold a real solid lead right now. Love their approach tonight. We're coming right back. Don't go anywhere. Whew, defense is there. Defense is there for sure. And as we head into the fourth, we'll see if there's a comeback in the works or if it's more of the same for the first three quarters. to Dandridge. Now here's Johnson. Here's Dandridge. Outside Johnson. Just five to shoot. It's hauled in by Nash. <laughs> I'll tell you what, they rebound the ball tremendously well. Lays it up and banks it in. And the Celtics lead by 14. Even with the score as it is, he just keeps coming at you. Pass to Dandridge. Now Allen fires from deep. Can't get it to drop. Fourth quarter still young. Just over a minute played. Isaac. Now here's Porter. Wide open. What? It's rebounded by Dandridge. Fine. The defense absent. That was a great opportunity, but no go. Takes it up with both hands and rips it down. And just a lack of fight right now on the defensive end. Right? Yeah. At least on that slam it was. That's one way to let a team back in the game. Yeah, defensively, your mantra at this point has to be no easy buckets. We've got a line change here for Boston. And keeping us updated from the sideline, Allie LaForce. Hey guys, during that last break, I heard Ime Udoka as he talked with the team. So far, he's happy with their play. But he wants to prevent any kind of a letdown. He told the team... <sighs> I like those, man, but I gotta be hitting these jump shots, man. That was that last jump shot attempt was an easy one. Thought I had it too. Here's Dandridge, following the bucket by the Celtics. Here's Johnson. It's tipped. Here's McGrady. Pass to Jordan. Shoots over Allen. Jordan misses. They get this rebound, but they haven't been able to keep up on the boards. They're lucky the game is as close as it is. To the wing, right side. Nowitzki, rebound Boston. Porzingis has got his fourth rebound in this one. To the inside. The no! <laughs> Nowitzki just go-go gadget arms. That was stupid. Not. Oh, that was dumb. Here's Nowitzki. He's got a piece of it. Allen against Jordan. And so he draws the foul. Headed to the line to shoot a pair. Ray Allen. Second personal foul. First free throw is good. At the line for the Celtics. Michael Penn. Both free throws good. Michael Jordan. And we're about three minutes into the fourth now. Two minutes, to Allen. Remaining in the game. Two, minutes. Two minutes remaining in the game. 
Here's Abdul Raouf. And here's Allen. Shot clock at six. Here's Ogauskas. And that one hits the back iron. Here in the fourth quarter, just under two and a half gone by. McGrady, shot is off. Great anticipation defensively. I love how he turned an easy look into a difficult play. And you know, technically, it's a high percentage look. But this is why we play the game. And they were really able to find the mismatches they wanted and exploit those all night. Great execution from the players and coaching staff for the Celtics. This team did a lot of things well tonight. That was early. I held on to that forever. And it was a team that was in rhythm. And they just trusted each other to take the right shots. And it's a performance that will signify their fifth win of the year. To the middle, Marbury. Count the bucket. Coming off a perfectly placed pass. Impressive job by this team. And you really can't discount the impact of this crowd here. They gave the team tremendous energy tonight. The fans were fantastic. It was a true home court advantage. True Here's home Andrews, court advantage. Following the bucket by the Celtics. Pass to Nowitzki. Here's Abdul Raouf. Looking to end the drought. Boston with a rebound. And we've got 28 seconds left in the fourth. Jordan with the I don't know how that went in, to be honest. I did not. Winning is all about. Did not deserve that. When it matters most. It's called killer instinct. It's one thing to be close at the end. It's another to finish. Pass to Dandridge. Here's Nowitzki. Here's Ogauskas. So we see the Celtics taking the W here. They didn't have too many problems tonight. <sighs> Man, didn't feel good. Didn't feel great about the jump shots, though. I had a couple. I only hit a couple. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. I made some easy ones, though. Ali LaForce and Steve Smith. I'm Brian Anderson. Thanking everyone for watching tonight's game. I gotta stop forcing jump shots. Trying to get my, trying to get on, on a groove. I'm kind of forcing them. Just gotta take them as they come.